welcome to Hot Rod Season 2. In this season, we have 20 teams and 40 cars. We have draw A and draw B, and draw B could be a lucky chance to get through to the semis. For the complete list of rules, check out the community tab and you will see a post there. In the heats, it's a points-based system. It's three for a win, two for second, and one for third place. Cars rotate over four races, so what do I reckon? Let's get into it. First up, we have Betsy Woods driving for Power Drive Racing in the Chevy Silverado. The 55 Bel Air Gasser is driven by Redline Salvage Inc. Up next, all the way from Australia in Brit Speed, is Mark D of CRC Racing. In the final car, we have Shamrock Racing driving the 2016 Alfa Romeo. Good luck, Hot Rodders! On the front line, we've got Power Drive Racing, Redline Savage Inc, Mark D and Shamrock Racing takes up the last position. Mark D's gone out hard and fast. Out of turn two, he's got the lead. Powers across the line and a big hit there by Power Drive Racing forces Mark D and Brit Speed off the track. We'll have a look at the replay very soon. Very quick time in an 8.60 in the very first outing of Hot Rod Season 2. Shamrock Racing just near the garages. Little nudge there on the back of Power Drive Racing from Shamrock. All bunched up around that turn one. And there's an easy victory there for Brit Speed, Mark D. And wham, what a hit. That's a big slam. In this tournament, cards do rotate, so each team has the opportunity of the inside track. Power Drive Racing takes out at turn one really quickly. Redline Savage Inc's trying to sneak past him. And as Power Drive gets a push by Mark D across the line. Hot Rods, the valley of speed, go hard or go home. Already in race two. Check out the gasser, he's really trying to get to the outside rail. Power Drive Racing pushes past and goes up high. Nice driving. Look at these guys, they're really on fire. Mark D takes the inside, Redline Savage Inks up the back. And they're all bunched up out of turn one. It's Mark D gets the advantage. The other three fighting for those minor points. All Redline Savage Inks over in the truck turning circle. And Mark D gets across for his second win. Currently on seven points out of race three. Fast and furious racing in Hot Rods, the first heat. There's Shamrock, he managed to get across the line. And Power Drive Racing stuck up at the garages. 55 Bel Air Gasser with Redline behind the wheel. Big Nige and Big Kev will sort him out and get him back up to the start gate. The Brit Speed pulling out a nice line out of turn one. How fast is this car? And there's the gasser, he's gone up high. Not enough juice to take the turn. And he's in the truck turning circle. Not a great place to be, really. Race four, the last for tonight. Shamrock Racing's got the inside. Power Drive Racing with some early speed. Almost goes over the track, and he's gonna take this out by the looks of it. Yes, he does in a 9.120. Very close results, look at that. Power Drive Racing on eight points. Mark D on seven. This is how quick this competition is going to be. The Valley of Speed. Let's go back to the replay. Check out the red car, Shamrock Racing. Goes the inside, oh, he's so close to getting through. And that just leaves it wide open for Power Drive Racing. Don't forget that this is draw A. So the other three teams that have failed to win tonight have another lifeline in draw B. Each team has entered in two vehicles, one for draw A and one for draw B. So the other lifeline could be the one that they need to get themselves into the semi-final. Here is your winner for tonight. It's Betsy Woods driving for Power Drive Racing. Congratulations. Leaders board after heat one, Power Drive Racing on eight points. Fast time tonight was a 9.120. And the fastest time tonight overall was by Mark D and Brit Speed of an 8.360. A big thank you to all our sponsors for making this event happen. Please go check them out on all their social media outlets.